and that's why you should never trust them, Adam. They make up everything. Ha uh ha -huh ha. -huh. Get it? They make up everything. Oh, man. That was off the chain. I sure love biology jokes. Yeah, that organic chemistry unit was so interesting. I can't wait to learn how cell organelles work. Mrs. Bartlett says they all have different functions like parts of a house. Hey, I have an idea. Let's go to my house and make comparisons between cell organelles and parts of a house. Great idea. Let's go. Hey! The outside of the house is like a cell membrane. Only certain things can enter and exit. I bet ninjas can come and go whenever they want. I guess not. Hey! I bet Spock from Star Trek could beam himself in. Apparently not. But if anything or anyone can get into a cell it has to be Santa Claus. He always gets into our house and we don't even have a fireplace. Ho! Ho! No! So, yeah, would someone come pick me up? Like right now. Don't worry guys. We'll be able to get in. This house is selectively permeable and I have a key. Let's go. Hi mom. Hello dear. Are these some new friends you brought over to play a cell is like a house again? I don't know what you're talking about, mom. Come on guys. Let's go check out the kitchen. Haha. <laughs> mom sure is funny. So here we are. The kitchen. What part of a cell does it remind you of? I've always thought the kitchen was like ribosomes. Ribosomes assemble proteins. And meals are assembled in the kitchen. Plus many meals contain proteins. Nice. Now let's go to the library. How neat is this? The library contains all these instructional manuals, recipes, and information. That would make the library like what organelle? Exactly. The library is like a nucleus because both of them store instructions and important information. Hey, why is there a toolbox on the floor in a library? Well, the nucleus makes ribosomes. Because tools make things in the nucleus is in the nucleus, we keep up here. Let's check out the bathroom next. Hey, the shower gets rid of germs and the toilet helps to dispose of waste. Isn't there an organelle that does something like that? You got it. Lysosomes break down and remove bad stuff from the cell. You really know your cell parts? Hey, let's go check out your bedroom. This is where I go at the end of the day after I've taken in all my nutrients. A good night's sleep and good food always gives me energy. What organelle makes energy for the cell? That's right. The mitochondria makes energy for the cell. Uh, dude, is that a copy of Goodnight Moon on your desk over here? Okay. So who wants to go see my mom and dad's room? Well, this is awkward, but my mom and dad's bed reminds me of the centrioles, because when the two of them are together in bed they... Ah, uh, dude, just stop. What? You thought? No. They eat churros in bed. And churros look like centrioles. I meant churros. You realize the centrioles also help the cell reproduce, right? Uh, don't you like have a sister or something? Can we go see her room? Wow! Look at all the storage she has in here. She can store all kinds of stuff. Wait! What organelle stores stuff for the cell? Exactly! It is a vacuole that stores stuff for the cell. How neat is that? Hey! Let's go see my mom's office. Welcome to the office. My mom sells stuff on eBay in her spare time. When someone buys something she packages it up and sends it off. Hey! Which organelle packages and transports stuff for the cell?
You got it. The Golgi bodies package and transport stuff around into and out of the cell. Looks like we are done so making cell organelle analogies. Not so fast. We forgot the maze-like organelle through which stuff moves. Luckily, we are in the hallway. And things move through hallways. Which organelle is like a maze through which things move? Absolutely. The endoplasmic reticulum. Fresh to death. Let's not forget the Cetus skeleton. It's like a handrail. Things attached to it then move around. This sure has been fun. Wait. How did that guy get in here?